Okay guys, today we're gonna need colorful markers, white glue, paper, scissors, and index cards for our umbrella pop out drawings. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your paper and your scissors and you're gonna need an adult for this and you're gonna cut it in half. It's not too straight, don't worry, because when you fold it over, you can just cut it off so that the paper edges are straight and they kind of line up with each other. So once you do that, you're gonna open it and then fold it again just so you have a nice clean line down the middle and then you're going to get your index card and you're going to cut that in half and we're going to cut a little bit off the top and again make sure you have an adult or an older sibling to help you with this then we're going to uh, fold it back and forth on the shorter end of the index card paper just until we get to the end so it should look like that, and we're done, and then we're going to start coloring it, whatever choice you want. I chose purple for my umbrella. Um, you can do whatever color, blue, red, yellow that you like. You can color the whole thing one color, or you could do the individual uh, strips. So I did every other folded box on mine. And I just colored it in. And again, you can choose any color that you want for this one. So then I refolded it again just so it was nice and crisp. And then you're going to fold it in half at this point so that the two open ends meet up. So this is where your white glue comes in here. We're going to want to take a little bit because too much might make it a little sticky and wet. And you're just going to squeeze it until they meet up so the end goal is that it sticks together. And you're going to fan it out, and then it should fit right into the middle of your paper. So then what you're going to do now is you're going to put your glue on the end, and you're going to just stick it maybe halfway up your page, and you're going to fold it just so that has a nice stick to it and again you don't want to use too much glue at the end that's your umbrella so next this is where your markers come in so I use purple again to draw the handle of my umbrella and then I decided to start drawing in my person so I'm just drawing their head and just coloring them in and they can be whatever color you want and I'm doing their neck and I got a black marker to outline the hair. I'm not too sure what color I wanted to do the hair yet, so I'm just leaving it blank. But it was just nice to have that outlined. Then I took a green marker to draw in the dress. And it doesn't have to be a dress, you could do a t-shirt, a sweater, whatever you feel your stick person should wear. Then I took yellow and I drew in the rain boots. So I just made sure to color it in. After I decided to draw on their hands, and I drew on little stick fingers and my person holding onto the umbrella. Then I decided to give them a smiley face, give them eyes, and then I took my blue marker to add in some puddles, just all around the bottom of my stick person, and then I started drawing on some raindrops for a nice rainy day. So you can put as many raindrops as you like, anywhere you want. It's really up to you. So I kept adding in my raindrops until I was happy. And then I added in some rain clouds. I colored those in. Added some more.
the hair. So I found John Marker and I just colored in the hair. And again, your hair color can be whatever color you like. After that, I decided to add a little bag to my sick person. And you can put whatever object you want in your hand, and there you go. This is a finished result. Hope you guys liked it. Enjoy your day.